thanks for tuning into my channel if you're new here welcome if you're a returning subscriber hey y'all if you are new go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell and when you get done watching this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up okay we all know that helps my channel so go ahead and help a sister out anywho today guys we are going to be doing a what's in my bag this is the bag of the day you know you got to give your old bags love just like you give the new ones love so i was like this bag is it today so this is the louis vuitton alma um mm yeah because it definitely is pm <laughs> i had to think about what it was you know what i hate i didn't get the bigger alma the one that's bigger than this one man i would have loved to have that size bag i wish i would have just got it a long time ago but you know how it is like sometimes you get one bag you're like okay i'm cool i got that style i don't need the trifecta but i think i would have really liked this in the damia bin print i probably will wear it a whole lot okay but anywho let's get to this so guys um the bag does zip up i was doing a little shopping today so this is an old bag too so my baby's a vintage <laughs> So it does zip up, but I had it stuffed, but I just wanted to show you that it does zip. Um, I found this cute little tag, which is a, like a little Alma tag from the beauty supply. And I was like, I gotta have that hanging on my bag because I no longer have the little cow bell thingy. I don't know what it's called, but that little lock. I have the lock <laughs> and the keys. I just don't have that little thing that hung on it. So let's go ahead and get into the contents of this bag. So, like I said, I went shopping. I went to the beauty supply. I've been had this, though. This didn't get purchased today. I'm going to, um, can I show y'all what's in this right now? I'll just do this right now because I have another bag. I decided to incorporate what's in my bag and my haul together. So, for those who like noise. All right, I just have some pocket, pop it sockets. And they're so cute. They are Hello Kitty. And this is the other one. I'm gonna give one. That I definitely am. Which one? I just don't know. Probably the blue one. Probably this one. Because I like the other two. <laughs> and then I bought some body oils. I haven't been to the mall. I normally go to Castleton Square Mall here in Indy and get my oils from um the oil man is uh smell good too is the name of his company but when i saw these the line was long so i was just standing there like oh yeah let me get that let me get that anywho i got i found coach poppy and i was waiting to come home to see if it smells like poppy because if so i'm gonna go back and get another one and send it to somebody well actually i'm sending it to Flyboo because she sent me this poppy. Let's see. Mm. Yeah, it, it smells like it. Is it note for note? No, but that oil with this spray, I'm sure it's going to be. Yeah. It smells good together because it has notes. It's probably just missing like one or two notes out of this oil. I'm not a perfume connoisseur when it comes to the notes and the ambers and the gardenias. Nope, nope. I don't know none of that. So I don't know what it's missing. I'm going to wear them together. That's all I know. Mm -hmm. I'm going to wear them together. Okay, then I found pink sugar. And y'all know I just bought some pink sugar body spray. So I got that. This is Nude. Rihanna's because that's one of my favorite. I can wear Rihanna new every day. I'm actually like a fourth almost done with my actual perfume bottle. I still have a travel spray, but I'm trying to find it. Somebody told me to look on Perfume Mania or somewhere like that. I'm definitely going to go on that site and get it. Y'all also sent me a sample of like Jimmy Choo in the mail. I got to get that. I don't know. I really haven't been buying perfumes lately because I have some that I'm trying to use. But I gotta get that Jimmy Choo. For you. Or is it just Jimmy Choo for you or whatever it is? Like, I gotta get it. I smelled it on that paper and that's what made me get this oil because I'm definitely gonna get the perfume. The perfume smells really good. I might have to get for him for my bag too. Okay, 
let's get into this and then we can finish with the rest of my haul yeah i know i'm looking like well today <sighs> you can't look good every day right you know you have to have your regular schmegler on at some point if y'all don't like me like this i do have on a little makeup though you know not a lot nothing you know nothing major just a little bit just just a little bit so i looked a little polished up close in person i didn't do anything to my hair because i have been putting heat on it for days and i'm like okay it's time to put some rollers in there and stop putting heat on it i need to go get my ends clipped but anywho this is me like you can catch me like this at some point like for real for real i don't go out the house trying to look my best every single day because that's just too time consuming, especially for me. If you don't like me at my regular, you definitely don't need me at my best, okay? Because you're going to see regular majority than my best. Wasn't it somebody, a celebrity, who ended up, like, breaking up with their boyfriend because they wanted them to... Tyra Brink... Ugh, I almost said her name wrong. Tyra Banks, wasn't it? When she was with Chris... Ugh, here I go. <laughs> here I go butchering words again. Yeah. I do believe hearing, I don't know if it's true, if it's just rumor or whatever the case may be, but I do remember back in the day when Tyra Banks dated Chris Webber, one of her complaints was he wanted her to get up every day before him and make her face up because he was so used to seeing her. He was attracted, shall I say, I guess he was attracted to her for the makeup look that when she took that look off, it was like, go put your face back on. And... I can see that because if I was a man and I met a woman and she's all glitzed and glammed, you know what I mean? And then she take it off and you look like a completely, completely different person. I would be like, you put no makeup on today? You, you gonna put your makeup on before we go outside? Like, <laughs> I'm gonna need that. You know what I mean? I'm gonna need you to keep that going. So I kind of like when I meet men with no makeup on, just like some jogging pants and a t-shirt because when I go and put on something fitted and put my makeup on and curl my hair and I come out for that first date, they like, okay, <laughs> okay, baby, we, you me, <laughs> let's go. Okay, well, anywho, because <laughs> we're too many minutes in and I showed y'all what's in this bag. All right, so this is the contents. I just got this little, um, what do you call this insert off Amazon? It's not a Samora, whatever that insert is i think that's the name of no this is not it this is just a little cheap one off amazon so i'm gonna start with what's not in the insert so i have what i was wearing today which is my product candy and of course i told y'all i got the oil too you know you're rocking the oils with my perfume to make them just when you walk past and make them smell you more all right and then i have that stinky hello kitty lotion I was telling one of these YouTubers one day when she had it, I'm like, oh, that stink. <laughs> like, I like coffee, but they could have made that Hello Kitty smell a little bit sweeter than what it does. Like, I was expecting a kitty sweet coffee or, you know, a kitty sweet pumpkin type smell. And no, baby. It's like grown woman, old lady pumpkin and a uh, caramel macchiato smell. Like, it stink. But I like Hello Kitty. And then I was like, let me go ahead and get it before they don't have it no more. So I did. All right, in this bag, I just have some um, Gain Scent Beads. And this bag actually comes from Swarovski. I had bought, uh, well, I didn't buy anything. My mom had bought me a Swarovski key ring and it just had the swan. And it was like all diamond out. Well, diamond out. It was all <laughs> crystalled out. It was just a crystal swan. And it came in this. So I decided to use this bag as... Um, Swarovski on there. I decided to use this bag as my little gain holder to keep my bag smelling fresh because this bag is old as I stated and it was in the closet for a long time like and it just has that old stiff smell in a way because you know leather just I don't know when it's oh it smells old but anywho this one is the pumpkin latte bath and body works is shutting this down all day long but anywho I wear it because I'm in the car by myself and no one can smell it. All right, and then let's go ahead. I have this little um, key ring I got. I have one like this already. Don't know what I did with it. It's around here somewhere. But this one had the little ball on it. And I was like, that is so cute. I need that. So I have the one with the little fur ball. This ain't even fur. I don't know what this is. I was looking for more. They didn't have any more. I would have bought them all. All right. Um... I have my eyeglasses. 
I'm sorry, my son texted me. I'm like, what? Okay, my Swarovski pen, pen. I do have pencils, but that's a pen. My Karagami uh, small wallet. They come in a three piece. Guys, if you are looking for something to buy from Louis Vuitton that ain't finna cost over $1,000, that Karagami set is very functional, okay? I love it. I use the biggest envelope as like a little uh, crossbody bag. You guys know this is in my purse majority of the time. I have our insurance cards. Oh, um, what else? Old ones, new ones, my dad's card. <laughs> I need to go through it and take the old ones out, but that's what's in here. And it holds about a good 10 cards. So even if you want to use this for a wallet, it will work out. It will work out. <laughs> I must be getting tired. It is kind of late in the evening. And I was like, let me go ahead and get this video filmed, you know, before I get all the way undressed and take all my makeup off. So as you can tell, my words are not coming out right. All that. I've been, I had a long day today. My work day today was nine to five. Okay. It was long. Normally it goes from 845 to 415. <laughs> <laughs> but that nine to five did something to me. Anywho, uh, I do have it hot stamped and it just has my initials, which are JB. Guys, I never introduced myself because my, my name is Julia. So it's like, hey, you know, you come click on it, say Julia B video. And then I'm like, I'm Julia, I'm Julia B. That's me. Okay, anywho, I have this. Uh, so let me just run down something real fast because some of y'all be tripping. This eyeglass case is non-authentic, but it could have fooled me and I have a ton of authentic items, so your girl bought it, okay? Boom. As y'all know, only way I can get this time stamped is through Louis Vuitton. Uh, this was another piece that I was like, yeah, send that to me, less than $100. I'm taking it, sure will. And it's like the little agenda, um, thought it was cute. So I bought it less than $100. No, it's not authentic, but it's okay. I do have a desk agenda, which I did pay for because in my mind, they were going out of stock and they wasn't gonna bring them back. And then what did they do? Louis Vuitton brought the desk agendas back. They suck. Okay, but anywho, this. And then I have my uh, key pouch. Yes, authentic. They bought me this. And then I have my pocket agenda because I need some type of calendar and I don't want to carry around a big agenda. And I just have, oh, that was my stickers. Uh, these stickers that I keep in here are from Elaine Michelle Studio. Oh no, yeah, I'm sorry. And they are just like your YouTube recording stickers. One says, upload, edit, film, voiceover, edit, film. As you can see, the row of upload is almost gone. <laughs> And I mean, I could buy the uh, Louis Vuitton insert. I'm thinking of buying it for 2023 because it's cute. I, I kind of like that one. All right. And of course it just holds three cards here. And yes, I did get it high stamped. I wish they would have had this design when I got my other pieces hop stamped because I would have got this instead of my initials, like for real, for real. And y'all, do y'all remember how they did my six ring key holder, bogus? This one wasn't perfect either. The same person hot stamped it. Y'all see that? The house not clear. Like they went over it one time, made a mistake. It was like, oh, let me do something else. And then just kept stamping it, even though now they got the look. Like, we're not going to talk about it. Then I asked the girl, I said, how long you worked here? She said, like, I've been here. I said, no, you just started since the pandemic happened because you wasn't here prior to the, to the pandemic because I was in here all the time. You know how I stamp my stuff wrong. Go get your manager. I got my... um my phone case and no i didn't get a new phone new phone i just got a replacement so i'm still using my s x max um i'm thinking about that 14 though because when the update came i noticed my niece and my mom was able to do the cinematic view uh recording but it's not on my phone so i'm like okay i need to upgrade all right and then i have my hello kitty tissues um this was purchased from Zola Salis and I also bought a stitch one I think all together I paid like 20 something dollars for both of them that included like the shipping and handling so I have those oh let me bring it back because y'all see people be looking like Mary Poppins just pulling stuff from somewhere 
And then I have my strawberry tech case. And guys, this mug is to the brim. I don't know if you can see it. I have like three different chargers in here. Um, I have an Android, my Apple, an iPhone with the USB, and the iPhone with the USC end. And my Apple Watch extra. All right, and then I have my, what do you call her? Tinkerbell. Okay, so y'all really getting to know me this year. And it's okay because as y'all should. If I would have kept doing videos consistently when I first started my channel and then when I went back to work, you guys would have been saw this already. You guys would have been knew this about me. Babe bought me this in 20, he went to Walt Disney World. Ooh, like 2018, no, was it pandemic? Before pandemic, I believe. And he got me Tinkerbell and the pen. Like, I know y'all seen the pen. For those of you who watch me, y'all seen this pen. Y'all done seen me pull this out my purse. My Tinkerbell pen. He bought me Tinkerbell, this, and a Disney cup. Because he know I love cups. So, in here... Yeah, I'm tired. I'm tired. <laughs> I shouldn't have tried to film this video. I just got a bunch of weather candies. Y'all know that caramel apple. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, next, uh, I have a USC base. I need to put this Bath and Body Works um, car set in my car. I have some bathroom spray. This one is fresh linen from the Dollar Tree. I have my AirPods. This case came from Amazon. And when I wear my Damien Abin print bags, I like, I like to hang it on the side. This is from the Dollar Tree. It is a ring light. I thought it was so cute. It reminds me of the one five below sales, but it's bigger. And it, it got a little brightness to it, y'all see? Like, it makes you look green if you ask me, but it gives you that little brightness if you hold it like this. See? Y'all see how it's lighting up, leaving that little shadow? This little thing is powerful. And it has a few different settings. So that's one, two, three. I will leave the link down below for this um, AirPod holder in case anybody wants it. It also fits your Mac Minis perfectly as well. All right, and we have emptied out this. What I liked about this um, insert is because it has one, two pockets here. And then, let me make sure this runs it. Then it has like these little, uh, let me just pull it out. It has these little wallet slots, wallet slots, card slots. So all together, it's four interior pockets. One, two with three cards three, four, and then it has the zip compartment. And I haven't taken tags off, don't ask me why. Probably cause when it, this is my first time using this bag since I put the, what do you call it, thing in here. So I never took the tag off. And then I'm gonna show y'all what's in this inside. These games got my personal is so good just fyi just let me tell y'all smells so good yeah i'm putting this stuff back because i do want to show what i bought besides the stuff from the beauty supplier because i went on a little shopping trip <laughs> yeah i will start back cash stuffing real soon it's just that over the summer i don't know if y'all know but um for those of you who knew I didn't work this whole summer and I hadn't got hired on at the job yet. And the, the temp service that I was working through wouldn't allow us to file unemployment due to the whole little COVID thing. I'm like, what? We got it the first two years. And then they was like, no, when we came back for the next semester, we, they was like, we're not giving you unemployment. So it's like, okay, cool. I got enough saved up to live off for the summer. So I'll be all right. So technically, even though I was getting child support and, you know, my YouTube check, I didn't want to stuff that because I'm like, why? I'm about to spend that. 
<laughs> I'm about to go shopping and enjoy myself. But anywho, um, my lip combo, I have that in my purse and it's just a little Mac. Y'all remember when this came out first year of uh, the pandemic. I told y'all I had them all. So that's what I have on today. And I have on my Juvia's Place Cola. I love this liner. Juvia's Place is taking over for MAC for me. Like MAC was my jam. Of course I wear Chanel. But when you wear makeup, like I think I tend, I turned to Juvia's Place because we were still kind of wearing masks. And I'm like, I'm not about to be putting on $35 lip gloss and lip liners just for my mask to take it off you know what i'm saying like i mean yeah i'm i'll buy it, but i'm not gonna just be wasting and throwing my money away like that if nobody's gonna see my face i'm not about to keep doing that and then i just have my hand sanitizer from bath and body works and flyboo sent me this um what do you want to say the sanitizer holder and it's just a little uh, ring so cute and I have it in there because, of course, y'all know the hardware on this Louis Vuitton. Alma is gold, like a brass gold. So, let's get to this shopping. I feel so bummy. <laughs> like, I should have did something with myself, but y'all, every day can't be a perfect day, right? Uh-oh, I didn't put this stuff in here right, so my zipper is wonky. If y'all remember seeing this, y'all know the zipper is, um, it ain't buttery brown like I want it to be. But anyway, let's move that over there and let's get to this haul. I probably do like two more hauls because I got to shop for my cruise. I still haven't ordered anything for that cruise yet, like a retard, and I need to. All right, so... First, I went to Hobby Lobby, and I just ordered some extra agenda refills, which I probably won't order a refill for my desk agenda through Louis Vuitton because this was on clearance for five dollars and some change. So why go ahead and spend sixty, seventy, eighty? Or was it hundred? I forget how much it is. But whatever. Why spend that when I got this for five dollars and it does the same thing? Some months I don't even write on it. Like, I might just write little stuff. But I got the foil days of the week to put on it. And I got the Agenda 50. This is the everyday planning. And y'all know I like it because it has like your travel. Hold on. Do a little flip through. So it has your sleep in your travel, um, your to-do, and then it has like when you're shopping, parties, another gold foil. I bought it for the gold foil because next year I'm just going to do in my plan is it's going to be gold and like black or gold and silver, gold and silver, gold and white. <laughs> So I got this because of the foils. But anyway, let's keep going because if y'all see, the foils on this one is gold too. So that's how I plan to do 2023 in my plan of just gold. Every little sticker is going to have gold in it. All right, so we got that out the way. So all together, Hobby Lobby only spent like $20.93 because again, they had like 40% off all Happy Planner and... um recollection no happy planner and what's the other one whichever one the planners they sell all right and of course you can't go to out shopping without going to Dollar Tree. i found some cute little uh spray bottles that i'm gonna give to somebody because they're pink since this is october i know i've been meaning to get some post office so i just i'd be forgetting my mind has been so one tracked because i have so much on it lately um i got some cute little pencil sharpeners i plan to sharpen up my eyeliner pencils with And I found some cute little um, notebooks. They got like a little plaid on them. They come with a little sticker. And they're just little notebook journals, you know. Because if you like me and you into what I'm into, you'll be randomly writing stuff in journals. And then you might not write none for a while. But I do journal here and there. Hence all of the notebooks right here. 
and all everywhere in my uh, little storage area. I actually bought two of those because I'm going to keep one for myself. So I just have two. Ouch, my hair pulled on the water. They had this cute little, um, y'all know they're trying to make everything have USC cords, right? So this is, let me open it up. The avocado. They just now bringing these out, the avocado. I think they had another coffee, so I bought it. And they had these adapters that allow you to turn your USB into a type C. Um, your type C to a USB. So basically I can use this cord, which won't be this one, but like when it comes with this type of bottom, you know what I mean? You plug it in there and then you have the USB. So I got a couple of those. Oh, I got another coffee. Oh, I got three of those um, converters. So two blacks. Nope, I lied. Two blues and a black. I thought those were nice to have. And then I got these cute little cluster, dramatic short cluster lashes. I was like, let me try those out. I think I have on Dollar Tree lashes today. Or do I? No, I don't. Y'all, I missed out. I had lashes in the bag with this, but I put them away. Because I was like, oh, let me see. I want to try these on. So I'll show y'all my eyelash collection one day, I guess, just so y'all can see um, if you want to buy some inexpensive lashes. So I thought these were really cute. I can't wait to try these. They only had three pairs, so I grabbed the three that I saw. And then they had this cute little uh, notebook that said Busy B. So I was like, hmm, let me grab that. I might send it to somebody. So basically, when y'all see me shopping, I'm really not even shopping for myself. I'm shopping to send stuff out when I feel like it. You know, you just you be wanting to send stuff, and then you be like, oh, I'm not going to send nothing. And then you're like, I need to send it because I don't want it. Or I need to give it away one. So, and I like giving stuff to the little girls at my school. Because they always like, Miss Brown, baby, can I have this? Or can I have that? And you're like, no. Because I always have like, kitty appeal and stuff but women like it too so anywho i'll probably go ahead and give that to somebody because i thought it was cute and guys that is it that is all um y'all bumming out with me today i appreciate it if you especially if you made it to this point of the video you know that means you rock with your girl so thank you so much for watching don't forget if you haven't subscribed go ahead and hit that subscribe button go ahead and hit that notification bell and go ahead and give this video a thumbs up okay until next time y'all bye